What's up, Cross Roaster Barbell? Happy Wednesday. For Wednesday, April 29th, 2020, your strength is going to be a five by five section of power clean. So we're gonna be working at like a 55 to 65%. If you guys don't have the weights to get to that point, uh, let's just go ahead and bump the reps up to like seven to eight. Um, but if you guys are working at that 55 to 65%, let's just go ahead and stick with the five by five. Now, uh, you guys are not gonna be on a clock, but I want you to be kind of aware of the time that's passing. Let's go ahead and start a new round of five, just about every five minutes. I want you guys to go into each set of five uh, being completely fresh. Um, this, is, this isn't something that you want to be under a lot of fatigue for today. Um, I'm suggesting that you guys do all singles. So very deliberate, power clean, drop, reset, reload, and go. So we're gonna go five by five. Now, with your power clean, let's go ahead and make sure that we are using the best form that we can. The weights are not gonna be pushing us to a point where things should be breaking down, so let's make sure that we are aware of our movement and quality. So, we set up with our feet underneath of ourselves. Let's go down and grab our bar with what kind of grip? Hook grip, exactly. Then, with our hook grip, we're going to have our eyes forward and down a little bit. But it's down, we're gonna have three distinct levels with shoulders, hips, and knees. We don't want our butt to be down like a squat. And from there, we're going to drive the floor away from us, keeping our heels down, reaching full extension, elbows pull high, and then we're going to rip those elbows through with a nice front rack. And then we stand and finish and drop, repeating that process for the five reps. You guys are gonna be using the same weight across, so we are not building the same weight. Part two, your bodyweight workout's gonna be an 18 minute air ramp. We're gonna have a very unique one for this uh, Wednesday workout. We're gonna go 50 supported bench hops, 50 seated Russian twists, 50 up down plank walk. So we've done all three of these. Um, I think we've done them in burn especially, but uh, this is gonna be new for most of you. So your 50 supported bench hops. Okay, you're gonna need a bench or a chair or something like that, maybe even a coffee table. But what you're gonna do is put your hands on that object. Uh, a bench is gonna be your best option if you have one. So hands on your bench, feet are together moving in unison, and you're going to have your feet off to one side of the bench. Then you're going to jump, keeping your hands on the bench, your feet over, and when you get over the bench, that's one, and when you come back, that's two. Each time you jump over is going to be a rep. We're gonna go 50 of those bench-supported hops. If you have a chair and you don't necessarily have a bench to get your feet over, um, let's just pretend and we'll just make sure we get our feet about uh, as high as our hands when we kind of hop over. I'll show you what that will look like. So your 50 seated Russian twists. You're just going to be sit seated on your butt. Uh, we're gonna have our hands moving in unison this time. Uh, our heels can be on the floor. We're going to simply touch the floor to the left, bring our hands over, touch the floor to our right. Each time we touch is going to be one rep. Then 50 up down plank walk. We're going to start in the up position of a high plank with our arms straight shoulders over our hands. From there, we're going to drop one elbow down to the floor and then the other elbow down to the floor and then one arm goes straight and then the other arm goes straight. So we're basically gonna walk up and down from a high plank to a low plank for, eight, uh, for 50 reps. We're gonna repeat this process 50, 50, 50 for 18 minutes. Um, I'm excited to see how this one goes. This, this should be a sweaty one. You guys are gonna get a lot of reps in. Um, and that's gonna be your body weight workout for Wednesday. Your equipment workout for Wednesday is going to be very familiar. You guys should be pretty used to this by now. This is the third day in a row we are gonna be doing the same volume for your machine. So if you're on the bike, sorry about your luck. I've been doing the bike and the bike is very difficult. So if you're on the bike and you're kind of looking at other people on the leaderboard, uh, don't really worry too much about it. The bike is much harder for these workouts. That is for sure. If you have a rower or a ski, that's awesome too. But your workout for Wednesday is going to be four minute rounds for five. So we're gonna go four minute AMRAP for five rounds. We're gonna go four minutes on your machine, followed by four minutes of rest, doing this five times. Now, your score is going to be all of those five rounds combined, calorie wise, okay? Now, what I want you to do is go back and compare. Go back and compare from Monday, go back and compare for Tuesday. The volume is exactly the same. You're gonna be on the machine for the same amount of time, but the duration for each round is gonna be much different. Some of you are going to excel in the faster sprints, like the one minute or the two minute. 
Some of you are going to excel more in your Wednesday, which is a longer duration, four minutes, and then we'll see what's coming on Friday, but it'll be even longer. So I'm curious to see how this all pans out. Um, but yeah, that is your Wednesday, April 29th, 2020. Have an amazing day. Stay after it.